So, rare replay. Welcome. It's us, them game chaps. Hey Hello. It's Bindi, Jamie, and Robin. It We're is. gonna play some rare replay. Into the theatre. So, yeah, I haven't really done too much of this. Yeah, I had a good old um, poke around with it uh, when it first came out and really enjoyed the variety and stuff. And go going back to things I haven't seen for ages has been really interesting. Look at all of this, there's just... There's a bunch oh, of good stuff. What happened to Rare? All sorts. Pretty much all new for me, really, I haven't yeah. I've played a little bit of... Banjo and Kazooie, but I haven't played any well, of these. Well, fun Banjo you mentioned that. Banjo and Kazooie. Banjo and Kazooie. <laughs> Let's start with that. It's 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 timely as it's ukulele. Timely. Yeah, I got my download up. code the other day. Hopefully, it'll be nice. unlocked soon. I fondly remember this game. Mm. Um, I fondle myself. I do as well. <laughs> oh balls. <laughs> okay. Oh, <laughs> oh no. <laughs> well, we've hit our first roadblock. It is so, yeah, Banjo! Banjo. Banjo! One of my strongest associations of this game was when I borrowed it from you and yeah. your brother and I accidentally deleted Ian's save. Oh. And I felt so bad. He didn't seem too bothered about S it. Sorry, past Ian. <laughs> Ian's my brother. <laughs> so, to put a timestamp on this, mm -hmm. ukulele is out in two days' time. Yep. So today is April the 9th. Um, and from what I can see, the guys clearly know what they're doing. Everything from the level design to the soundtrack to the gameplay. It it's a spiritual it successor good. to Banjo. It is looking promising, but we'll, we'll, I guess we'll see for sure in a few days. But um, We're going to play this to get us in the mood. Yeah. I think I played a little bit of this on the DS, didn't I? Oh, yeah, there was a DS... No. Yeah, there, there was there was a it was a GBA game, and I had it on the original DS. Because that's the only I know I played it like he is right now. Yeah, <laughs> it couldn't have this, been banjo obviously. banjo. Yeah, because it was yeah it was kind of a top down sort of yeah. look. Damn it! I was trying to do the thing where it spins around. Ah, exposition, exposition. Oh it my like god! This. Look at this. This is so cool. If it looked the same as this, it wasn't on the DS. Yeah. Hmm. Okay, maybe I didn't know. I'm glad my voice isn't as annoying as that. <laughs> it's not far Ooh. enough, but... Ooh. Ooh. Uh. Are, they just, are they all just having strokes? Yep. I like me some... Come on, we just want to do some I levels. also do really want to have... A house that is my face one day. I want to live in the side of a mountain or whatever. I think I'm already pretty good enough. Do you think she started wearing the the big hat so that her house could be bigger? Yeah. Give she needed extra... more room, and she yeah. was thinking, "We're in." Right. Free. Oh, uh, we have to learn loads of moves, don't we? I forgot about that. Yep. It uh, it looks. Pretty sharp, actually. I mean, some of the uh, like the ground textures are a little bit muddy. But, because it's um, that kind of cartoony style, though. It gets away mm. with that. See, if they did this for for ban um, for conquer, like even just like this movement and switching the camera, yeah, is really good. I don't know how much work they did to um, brush up the uh, nope. the feel at all. Oh my, it's it's flowing back. I'm not even having to. Oh, the muscle memory. It seems like the way you feel about this is the way I feel about Crash Bandicoot. Yeah, that seems about right. I hate onions. <laughs> Get away from me, you This onion. This game is secretly teaching uh, kids to hate vegetables. Like, oh. Kick your vegetables. Yeah. Kick them right in the flying, face. Flying cauliflower mutant creatures. Or to eat them out of spite. <laughs> to cause them pain. Yeah, because they're secret... If your vegetables have eyes, do not trust them. Because there's secret honeycombs in them. Is it, uh, this is, can you do the Box one where stamp. you like, you know where you do like a barge forward, if you crouch and oh, then yes. press attack? Ah, that's the one. Nice. You've got loads of you got options so right off the bat. My favourite is still the one where you can um, put your feathers down and become this like golden like invincibility. <laughs> yeah, except not the Mario music. <laughs> 
or but just being able to like walk. You know, if you do that and then yeah, yeah, yeah. Kazooie takes you on the back. Yeah, it it is a little bit annoying that um, she makes the noise the whole time you're doing it yeah. because you are constantly walking around like that because it is fun and feels fast. Yeah, but um, well, it's the best way to travel. Yeah, camera's been rustled out oh, of control. Oh. Waterfall. <gasps> Secret thing in waterfall. Candlestick. No, it's not. It's that guy from that film. Lumiere. Oh, look at this. Mm, like proper doggy the paddle. water texture in this is noticeably better than Blast Corps. <laughs> yeah. But not by much. Yeah. Um, I think we've done it all. There's, isn't there, I think there's another thing in the hole in the water there, under the mountain, under yeah, the bridge. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. There. <gasps> I, I played oh, through man. this relatively recently, like a couple of years ago. Oh, no, we're missing one. We must be able to get one more. Mm. <laughs> That's something that games have done a pretty harrowing job on. Um, drowning. Mm. Lara Croft, uh, Super Mario 64, probably this. Drowning animations in games mm. are horribly oh, yeah. no, uh, traumatising. Really yeah, there's also like generally. Again, to teach that, kids like horrific lessons. There are <laughs> very few examples. Don't you know. like, I can't, off the top of my head, think of any good examples of underwater swimming in 3D games. Yeah. You can't think of any good ones? No. GTA? May I mean... Oh, no, definitely not. Really? GTA, did you say? Yeah. No, I don't think so. Like, it just, to me, it always Ooh. feels slow and... It is. And swimming underwater. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. Like, and I get that I that's realistic, but it's just not fun. That's why yeah. I don't. Oh, okay, that's why right. I don't go you swimming don't underwater it. very often. Yeah. <laughs> like to me, I think the best example I can think of is uh, as a Zora Link in Majora's Mask. Yes, where you can just like glide. Yeah, and that, that is not perfect, but it's pretty good a lot of the time. So, but what you're kind of saying is more like how. It being fun, more less than it being realistic, is what. I yeah, yeah it's just, and it, it, it often but the fact feels that games, bad. Games will go out of their way to make the physics accessible like this, but for whatever reason, swimming has to be realistic and slow. Mm. Yeah, I see what you mean. Swimming's really slow in Breath of the Wild. I hate, yeah. I hate being in water. In that yeah. Game, <laughs> even with the Zora stuff. Yeah, it would be nice if, <gasps> if when you fully upgrade the Zora stuff, it's music changed. Da, 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 da. Like oh, that's it, yeah, all the, all the music for the lair is like, if you mm. go down to the woods today, you're sure it's a big I surprise. do really, like, I remember really uh, appreciating the, like, contextual music changes. Yeah. So like, great. when you start walking towards an area, the music's still the same, but it just gets a bit more Christmassy. Yeah. Like, it starts jingling. Yeah, yeah. Did this come mm. before Crash Bandicoot? No. No. How far would this one have been through that generation? Like, at least halfway through. It was fairly early-ish to have Banjo really? as well. Yeah. Well, you think this because this came like a fair way after um, Diddy Kong Racing because that was Banjo's first appearance. So I want to say this. So let's do the subtle change. So as you get towards this, the music changes. Nineteen ninety-eight. I think it's more. Sorry, I interrupted that. My bad. Yeah, but no. I'm just gonna have to do I, it again. I was, I was gonna guess ninety-eight. Just after Ocarina of Time was my guess. Whee. Oh wait, it's on top of here, isn't it? Yeah. I'm not stupid. Don't you need to do the, I need the, the move. funky walk. Can you do that now, or do you need to unlock that? You need to unlock it. Jiggy. Because otherwise, that's how you get up there. Yeah. So if I go in, if I get this and go into the world, I can learn the funky walk. I still think the jiggies look good. Like they're well modelled. Mr. Jiggy. Will do, kid. I really like the um Sorry, just so you know, as well. before you carry on. Uh, Crash Bandicoot was 96. So. Yeah, Ooh. that sounds about right. So not that much in it, then. Come on. Go, go, boy. Yeah. Zing. <laughs> such, such a good zing, isn't it? Just everything about this game is so magical. 
So what's your Scott. feelings? <laughs> what's your take on the way they made uh, all the characters look in Nuts and Bolts? The suit, the like hyper stylized version. I remember very little of that game. Mm. Wait, do, do, do. wait, really slowly. Oh, I wasn't doing. It. Anyway, Mumbo's Mountain and Robin's in. Oh, okay, cool. Switch it up. Three new moves. Of course, you learn all like the egg attacks and stuff. Yes. So you, you definitely learn the climbing one in here. <gasps> Jinjo! Jinjo! Can I... Yeah, if you crouch and then jump. Oh, no. You do Can your I... backflip. Oh, God. Is that thing here? Right. Oh, oh, there's oh, so oh, much oh, going oh. on in this game. So many houses. <laughs> yeah, there's, there's so a lot of houses in Chinese. <laughs> on the notes and... Uh... I feel like okay, doing this, is this actually... game on drugs would probably ah. be... This isn't as relaxing as I thought it was going mental. to be. Go away, leave my honey guns alone. Quiet. Take you just killed a, a sentient being. <laughs> You're a murderer. <laughs> I feast on his golden hearts. I just love all the sounds in this game. So where can I find... Because I, I want the talent trot. That's what I want. Um, Maybe up here. Around. There's a bottles thing. Oh yes, uh, yeah, go and speak to him. Yeah, yeah. This is where you learn it. You have to stand on that impressive thing. <laughs> Doesn't like it. Oh, okay, it was X. X. Sorry. Here we go. Yay! And then we can run away. Let's go. Yay! That's it's one of my favourite modes of transport. Dead. Got stuck. Eh, eh, eh. Imagine carrying that massive. Look at him. He's just there, like. You missed Whoa. one, Robin. Oh yeah. <laughs> OCD. Eggs! There are eggs. Beep, beep. Thanks, Jiggly. There are dancing eggs. What do they do? They dance. So we'll learn the move that lets us fire eggs. Who are the eggs? Hup, de, de, fa, hup, de, de, fa, hup, hup, hup. Yeah! So if you butt slam all the houses, there's a Jiggy. Eh. Cool. I don't say something accidentally racist. <laughs> Oh, I don't have the uh, thing yet. No, you don't. Oh, wait, I think he's off to the right there. Yeah, there yeah. we go. With the flowers. Oh, my God. A bumbleger. A bumbleger. It's not like you're saying bumbleger. Bumbleger. A bumbleger. You are a bumbleger. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Nice. Nuts and bolts. Oh, God, now I have to collect all of these. The camera is quite sharp. When you move, yeah, it's it because maybe afford to be a bit further out most of the time. I mean, it might be because I think the hangover is starting to kick in a bit, <laughs> but <laughs> it is disorientating. Ah. You want to piss on me? <laughs> it's so bad. <laughs> yeah, combat in this game was never a finesse. Jinjo, but it's not the main thing. It's about. But the it's the ever. it's the exploration and the the world design and the atmosphere. Hasn't. Yeah. Oh yeah, there's some really tricky puzzles in this game. Uh, so well, I can't shoot eggs, eggs yet, those. can I? Why can't you just go and get the honeycomb guy? If you go down the hill, you might be able to learn it there. Yeah, I feel if you can walk on that hill. Yeah! Bam, bam. Oh. There's a big old monkey man. Oh, yeah, we're going to fight him in a bit. Yeah, you've got to get 100 notes, don't you? Which we oh, need yeah. to do because that opens up areas for us. So Is that okay? Let's go. Slip yeah. Yeah, it's got a very good um, Metroidvania style to it of the more moves you unlock and stuff, you can go back and do other challenges. Right. Or like, you can unlock things later which make you like uh, uh, speedy shoes. And there's a couple of races which, when you first come across them, are really difficult. Yeah. But if you go back with the shoes, they're a piece of piss. No! Ah! Is something you find in quite a lot of games. They're like, Damn. I'm a little cute character. Save yeah, me it makes me think of Gobbo's as well. That's yeah. exactly what it makes me think. From Rayman. From uh, Gobbo's. Croc. Croc. Is, yeah, Croc. I used to make me cry because I thought the Gobbo's were so cute. If I couldn't get to them, I'd be really <laughs> upset. They're dead. Yeah, if you go and get that honeycomb, we get an extra life or something. Yes. Because I've uh, already got five. Yeah, let's see if I can drop down from above it. 
Yeah, what are the things in Rayman? They're like little blueberries, aren't they? <laughs> I don't know what they're they just are. Just delicious Weird blueberries. <laughs> nice, nice, nice. Yeah. Here we go. Cool. Hey. Oh, awesome. We're doing monkey, it. Monkey, monkey, They're like, monkey, the man. sense of progression you get is um, is good. Works fast. Oh, steady calm. Orange. You throw oranges onto those things. Yeah. Yes. Damn, he's got a lot of oranges. Do you know, you say you don't... I actually really like the noise that she makes. I find it really appealing. It's like... They probably created that by having very, very quick, violent sex on their bed. <laughs> <laughs> ah! What did doing the oranges... What did that achieve? I can't remember. I don't know. How do I get an orange for him? Oh, you have to uh, slam into it, yeah, to knock that one down. Oh, can I climb? Yeah, yeah. Climb it. There we go. Yeah. Quite you. Oh god, the orange is alive. He wants to be eaten. I long for death. <laughs> Kill me. Consume me. <laughs> Fat bear, how rude. Yeah, loads of people make jokes to a banjo's weight in this. Nope. <laughs> yeah, this is where he'll teach you to um, yes. shoot eggs. Eggs, 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 oh, eggs, eggs. Oh god, I didn't like that camera change. Huh? Oh yeah, he can also poo them out. He goes, shoot. <laughs> I would not want to shit one of those eggs out. Look, it's as, it's as big as his legs. It's really massive. Oh wow, yeah. It's bigger than Kazooie's body. Oh. It's like shitting out kidney stones. Oh, wait, no, you pee kidney stones out. I don't know. I what am I, a doctor? Call his bluff. Die. Ah! Oh yeah, go and slam on that. That'll open up something in the world. Yeah, I do there's like so the many, interconnectivity. Like, yeah, there's so oh, many like so secrets peace. and like transporting things, and it's yeah, it's got a very good. It definitely took inspiration from Mario's like um, painting kind of like hub system. Mm. But I think a lot of a lot of um, games did. Jeez. Arguably, that's uh, what helped to make Dark Souls the game it was. What? <laughs> I think Zelda makes Dark Souls the game it is. But what came before Zelda? Well, Ocarina of Time. Zelda. More, more Zelda. Yeah. I mean, like the original Legend of Zelda. Yeah. Um. Oh, feel, four more feels very Dark Soulsy. They ate it. Why do they eat everything in this world? So they can shit it out. <laughs> Just look. That's it's that switch of uh, music. The only thing that I um. St still didn't feel entirely right in this game is the fact that a lot of the collectibles oh, are... Oh, go back, go back. you got a, a, a jiggly mega diggy. A jiggly jog? What? A jiggly jog. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that, definitely, that definitely sounds like some sort of slur. A lot of the collectibles are two-dimensional objects, makes them sometimes hard to know exactly where they are. Yeah. Uh, you can go and get turned into an ant. And yes. climb that tower. Let's do, let's do that. And I'll hand it over to you and you can be Ant Boy. You can turn into oh, and dishwasher can do this. in this game. Yes, you can. Oh, there's another one in there. Oh, they're just everywhere. What do you do? Throw eggs in there. <laughs> that's really weird. I didn't realise that was actually, when you were talking about that, that's actually yeah. a thing. <laughs> what the thing. Might be easy to shoot. <laughs> and if you do the backflip now, you'll get the honeycomb. Nope. I should have done it earlier before I smashed them all. Damn it! Now I've been made to look a fool. I mean, you're doing a very good job with this fool business. Quite you. We are smashing this out. One more to go, guys. Boo! Ant time. Oh, we need one more. Oh, God, yeah, because he's, uh, he's I... in love with the main villain, Villainess. He's got a weird, sexy relationship going on with um, oh, Grintilda. Yeah. Well, when she, when she turns sexy, Into he's like, Beckham. yeah, and he goes, he's he's all over that. I swear, it is it like it's it, it Sometimes in here it is. somewhere behind this chair? I thought. I know you were there just there. No, I thought it was in here. Maybe it's in the ant hill. Yeah. 
The sound design in this game is great. Mm. Yeah, there it is. No bears. Yeah, they call him fat, they call him ugly. It's it's very bearist. Very bearist. Mm, it's barely acceptable. It's, it's so unbearable. That's that's the better joke there. The bear to joke. Mmm, you ruined it. <laughs> <laughs> I'd say that was the bare minimum. Mmm. Stop berating me. <laughs> Robin's just shaking his head. <laughs> I do that. I'm just going. I'm saying the word bear over and over again. I've baroked him. <laughs> Wait, am I doing this or is Bindi doing this? No, you you can do it. You do it because I, it'll take me too long to figure out what I'm doing. Okay. Because <laughs> I Whee! don't know with you guys. Woo. So yeah, uh, later in the game, you get, you can get turned into a washing machine. Since when can ants jump like that, like a spider? I mean, not hey, spider don't you know jump. anything about ants? In my pants. Where did you get those shorts? I like that. Hey, give me that cool shorts. backpack. You stay away from that. It is a cool backpack. Well, he's he's done very Hulk. Like he transforms and still has the things. No. Ah! It does creep me out a bit that the ants are pink. Like well, it doesn't like seem right. Yeah, it makes them feel, seem more like fleshy and weird. They should weird. be. They should be a different color. We need more notes. We do float quite a lot. Whee! Ah. Right, third time's the charm. What's fourth time if you count the other time I fell off? Whoa. Whoa. <sighs> hmm. Close. I like this. Let's just do this over and over again. <laughs> All right, less of your sass. Let's cut everything else out and leave just this in. Just on repeat. Yeah. Yeah! No! <laughs> <laughs> right, I need to stop going for that top part because the level design's blocking me off. Yeah. Yeah, I love it. Again, again. <laughs> I mean, it's no... <laughs> no! <laughs> Oh, I, I need I need to channel Dark Souls. I need to channel L with Ledge of Ledge Death. Of Death. <laughs> first time, I can do it first time because I believe I can do it, and I'm bloody amazing. Mm. It feels like there's much less at stake here. Yeah, so. that's true. <laughs> <laughs> Let's just take it at a time. Taking the scenery. So as as Mugger would say, just just take your time. Just... Lucy Goosey. Lucy. Okay. Lucy goes real Lucy, nice. Just float just gonna... over to that next one, yeah. yeah you float, yeah. float to the next. <laughs> float, float. Oh. Well, see if when you when you land. I feel like I don't have any good control. See if you can anymore. like calm. land without oh, moving go. forward. So there if you do get go. on. Now he's taking it real calm. There's another section to go. Oh God. It's just it's just chilly. Keep it chilly. Oh, it's so chill. Yes! yes! Suck it! <laughs> Suck it! Don't fall off. Oh my god, please don't. <laughs> it's stressed. You just feel like you're giving me your sticky tick like, to the edge. Because <laughs> I, feel, I feel you can just accelerate and have no control over yeah. that. Yeah. Up, two, three, four. Up. Oh, that honeycomb. Oh my god. Makes Yay! me so sad. Yay! Now jump. To freedom. To, into the water. We did it. To freedom! No fall damage. Ooh, I know what I can do. What? You can leave the level, I think. Yes, you can. As an ant. Is that what you need to do to get the one on top of it as well? Yes, because I think that's too steep for Kazooie. So you do this. <coughs> Although I think we have just lost all of our notes. I think when you leave the level, you lose the notes. Really? Hooray! I really hope not. We'll find out. <laughs> oh no! Brilliant, we can still get notes. Right, we need to get more notes. How many have we got? Nine more to go, and then we've aced this level. <gasps> I can do this again. Right. Oh, get the. Do the. Uh, yeah. The tower. Need one. Is it one you need, probably? We'll see. Change me back, magic man. Change me. 
Challenge me. Hold me like a, hold me like a, hold me like a, hold me like a. Bomb in my face. So in um, Nuts and Bolts, they did have that weird, like super angular art style, um, which I kind of liked in theory, and I thought like Mumbo looked really good, but I felt like made Banjo and Kazooie especially not feel like themselves anymore. It looked it looked good on some of the characters, but not so much on the main ones. Mm. Whoa. Yay! Excellent. Right, so where do you get these final notes from? Are they underwater? Yes. I say that. I'm just gonna go for it. Whee! So I don't, I don't think I got the underwater ones. Whee! Yeah, there we go. See, I just love the transition. Oh, I like that too. Mm. But it, it perfectly captures the environment you're in. Mm. Yeah. Breath of the Wild seems quite good at that as well. Mm, yeah. Well, yeah, like Nintendo in general is does a really good job of those kinds of details. And for ages it felt like Rare was one of the only other companies I could think of that m made the same kind of effort to those sorts of details. Yeah. That was a terribly constructed sentence, uh, you know what I mean. I'm, yeah. Three more notes. Ah. Cow. Let's go this way. Might be one of these. Hooray! Yeah. We've done it. We're amazing. Yeah. I'm gonna live forever. <laughs> Whee! So, what does getting all the notes do? Uh, well, it's. Oh, they they, they unlock open doors. Doors, yeah. yes. So, though you need like moves to get to certain areas. Um, and you need you need jigsaws to get into the levels, but you need notes to break through the doors. Ah. As we will now discover. Excuse me. What a babe? How do we look? I think we're told there's still a really good villain. There's definitely a, a, a zoom feature. I'm pressing every button. Maybe click the right stick. No. I swear you used to be able to zoom and look at stuff. Mm -hmm. Anyway. Now we can go up here, and we need how many for this door? Fifty! Ah, suck it, door. So yeah, first first impressions of playing this again, in anticipation for the ukulele. It's got a very mixed uh, and varied kind of combat and mm. movement base. It's got intricate level design that is well connected, and uh, thematically it's very strong. Yeah. Um, a great soundtrack and hilarious sound effects. Yeah. Um, and generally it feels very smooth and, and nice to play and fun. Yeah, I it feels remember good. games are fun. I do remember <laughs> that. Look at these guys. Like